Hey all, in this uh, video I wanted to go through with you on uh, on the powerful audience persona journey template, okay? So here we did already uh, set up the workspace. In this workspace we are targeting homeowners who are looking for a bagless vacuum cleaner or housewives who want to clean their homes without the hassle and dust from traditional bagged vacuum cleaner um, we have an audience we have a persona with us so michael is a 39 year old household owner he has been looking for a vacuum cleaner with a bagless design power cord and easy to use controls he is searching on the internet for the best bagless vacuum cleaner that doesn't need additional tools to clean carpets and hard floors okay so we have gone through this uh, research steps um, athena has already filled all the demographic steps uh, your semantics uh, all the information that you need uh, to target your content based on semantics and psychographics now we are going to create using our template predefined template for customer journey so let's pick up uh, the master template and customer decision journey and we are going to go deeper in the customer journey so here the main topic of interest is bagless vacuum cleaner okay so bagless vacuum cleaner and our initial content idea or the main problem solution statement here is to go deeper into our customer journey so design customer journey steps for um, uh, for our target audience okay um, and and you can be a bit more specific here the way you want but uh, our goal or idea with this content is to tell artificial intelligence ai and uh, athena the internal ai with crawl q to to create and design for the customer journey steps based on the template that we are using problems we are going to what problem this content or template is going to solve for us this is what we want to tell ai so it's going to help help us to target our persona with the right message right message at the right time right that's what we want we want a solid content strategy based on buyer persona that will help us to target our audience our intended persona with the right message and right time on the right channel so persona with the right message at the right time on the right channel okay that's that's our goal for this content strategy we are working on using ai powered listening and buyer persona approach and this is very high level overview but the heavy lifting has already been done by athena athena has already researched about this product philips power pro bagless vacuum cleaner its commercial advantage disadvantage persona pain point everything is pre-done words of worth of months of research that you can do by yourself browsing thousands pages of internet that is already in there so let's go through this uh, persona decision journey steps uh, the first one five drivers to trigger the awareness stage of my ideal prospect you understand this right the top of the funnel awareness stage so you can start ads or article uh, the pay date or articles about vacuum cleaner that don't require bags review of the vacuum cleaner you can start with the reviews you can start with social media posts about vacuum cleaner that don't require bags you can start uh, emailing your target list 
you can do the pro product demonstration so that's how you can generate awareness then you can create content which focus around the barriers on this awareness so barriers on the awareness are the following topics so lack of time to research best vacuum cleaner this is a barrier right difficulty understanding the differences between vacuum cleaners there are several types of vacuum cleaner in the market so very difficult to understand which fits for your purpose in this case we are targeting household people who, are, who have children pet and they also have symptoms of allergy they want silent vacuum cleaner right and they don't want to spend a lot of time cleaning worried about leaving mess behind after cleaning that's also a barrier uh, for getting an awareness stage to a vacuum cleaner concerns about vacuuming carpets and hard floors with the same appliance so many times vacuum cleaner comes with a lot of different small equipments you need to fit them to get the carpets and hard floors that's their barrier you can you can address those barriers you can address doubts about whether a bagless vacuum cleaner is the right choice for them right then five solution to trigger the awareness stage so sending an email blast to all household owners uh, can be interesting one placing online ads sponsoring a webinar or podcast on how to choose the best vacuum cleaner for your needs producing a video on how to use the new vacuum cleaner without leaving any mess or frustration behind distributing flyers in the local supermarkets and department stores highlighting the key features of the new vacuum cleaner this is very interesting right if you are a um, company like uh, Dyson or, or in this case, sorry, we are talking about Philips. Uh, for them, it makes sense to distribute flyers in the local supermarkets and departmental stores highlighting the key features of the new vacuum cleaner. Now, action, take out action to trigger the awareness. And we are going to going more deeper with this, but we are in the awareness stage, top of the funnel stage. Watch a video about the product on the company website, read customer reviews on the product, compare prices with different websites, check for the special offer or discount. You can almost take each of these points and start an actionable content strategy with your marketing team, right? This is exactly how this works, this uh, customer decision journey. Now, we go from awareness stage to desire stage. So, five drivers to trigger the desire stage. Innovative design right innovative design a vacuum cleaner that is easy to use doesn't require any additional tools to clean carpets and hard floors that is innovative design that's what will trigger their desire lightweight and portable that is what it will trigger their desire powerful suction that is what will trigger their desire affordable price that is what will trigger your ideal prospects desire bagless design a vacuum cleaner with bagless design that makes it easy to clean up after use without having to worry about disposing of bags or cleaning filters that that is what it will trigger the desire stage of your ideal prospect barriers to these are the now barriers you need to handle those barrier uh, to the desire stage of your ideal prospect that is again lack of time lack of knowledge high price tag weight a lot of vacuum cleaner are heavy and difficult to move around the house household owners are looking for a lightweight easy to use vacuum cleaner that doesn't leave any mess or frustration behind so weight size price tag these are barriers to trigger the desire stage of your ideal prospect then you can provide solution provide a list of the best vacuum cleaner that are bagless and don't require any additional tools or showcase customer reviews explain the benefit describe how it is easy to use a vacuum cleaner that is bagless and doesn't require any additional tools to clean the carpet and hard floors right so you can see that um, you can go deeper into the desire stage take out action on the desire stage michelle she's our uh, michael sorry michael she's our audience target audience and for michael it makes sense that if he reads online reviews of the best bagless vacuum cleaner then it is a takeout or call to action for for michael so you can create so many call out actions for your ideal customer using this strategy or uh, send him to product demonstration video or 
uh, send him a price comparison or uh, fill out a form on the website to purchase the vacuum cleaner he can you can also set a survey or form that he can fill out right so there are different call to action content strategy ideas here in the desired stage of your prospects funnel then after they have expressed their desire how to move them into the initial purchase consideration stage right so now michael is interested in finding a vacuum cleaner that is easy to use he is getting interested his desire is already triggered he is looking for a vacuum cleaner that with bagless design power so now we are sure that our ideal persona has gone through the desire stage right it's not uh, it's really looking into that bagless solution right he's searching on the internet for the best bagless vacuum cleaner and that's the stage where you are going to address those barriers so barriers in this stage of the initial purchase considerations are that um, he's busy michael is busy and does not have time uh, he wants lightweight vacuum cleaner he wants vacuum cleaner with bagless design so these uh, some of these are like he wants a vacuum cleaner with easy to use controls so these are the different purchase consideration stages and these are the barriers solution read reviews look for a vacuum cleaner that comes with the power code for easy to use so you are addressing more specific more more specific solutions right to the initial purchase considerations similarly you will have some call out action which is specific to the purchase initial purchase consideration stage of your ideal prospect once michael makes active purchase from from philips in this example then uh, these are different triggers to to keep the active purchase stage then these are the barriers the solutions um, then once uh, the purchase has been made you want to make sure that the michael is getting rewarded right during the use of the product he's uh, getting motivated to to the post purchase action as a brand you want from from this uh, uh, from this uh, campaign right from the from the campaign you want post purchase actions brand loyalty actions so you see like uh, i can spend a lot of time on this video but most important thing is to understand that based on the audience persona research we have created a framework from this framework you can go as deep as possible into the different stages of your customer decision journey and you can create a perfect content strategy market messaging strategy that act on the specific entry points and exit point of that decision journey from starting from awareness stage until the end of brand loyalty and retention stage right so i hope this video gives you quite in-depth understanding of uh, how crawl queue is designed to create buyer personal research from active ai powered listening with the integrated reddit and cura social listening and using this data there's a powerful internal ai layer which then help you along with different templates and frameworks to create a specific content strategy a specific content that help you to target the persona help you to create campaign that give you more roi right so i hope uh, this uh, video really helps you to get a glimpse of what crawl queue is capable of i'm i'm just scratching the surface here right and you're most welcome to follow up in the comments and i'll be happy to provide you more such examples videos in in future so keep an eye on this and wish you uh, great luck in exploring the solution crawl queue yes this is ai powered solution to make the content strategy to create a strategy that works on different channel right okay bye for now and uh, i'll catch up with you soon when an another exciting in product demo taking a real life example of the product and the customer decision journey or other different kind of content that you might ask me in the comments so you can just comment and ask me different types of demos content any kind of idea that you want me to explore through crawl queue